welcome back to my kitchen guys today i'll be making me some chicken chop suey in a, my kitchen the jamaican way so if you want to learn this delicious quick and simple recipe please do not forget to subscribe and hit that like button for more cooking videos let's get this process started guys i've got all my ingredients here guys first i've got my broccoli right here I'm gonna use some broccoli to steam down with my pop choy. Got my pop choy right here. Let me show you guys what it looks like. This is it. Haven't cleaned it as yet. I'm gonna clean it up and show you guys how I do it from start to finish. Looks really nice. All right. Fix them up. Put this back right here. Over here, I've got my chicken breast, and I've already cleaned and cut up my chicken breast with vinegar and lemon juice. I've got my dried seasoning. I've got me some black pepper right here. Some garlic powder. I'm gonna use all of these dry season to season my chicken. I've got me some ginger garlic pimento some all-purpose seasoning, some onion powder, some soy sauce, got me some salt to give my pot added flavor, and I've got my seasoning right here. I've got me a piece of white onion, I've got me two stalk of scallion, one large carrot, and I've got the bad boy, my scotch bonnet pepper. So guys, if you wanna learn this recipe, please stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe. Let's get this process started. So at this point, guys, I am going to season my chicken breast. As you could see, it's filled with water. So I'm just going to pat dry my chicken breast before I season it, because we don't want all that water in our seasoned chicken, all right? So, pat join it. All right. And it looks perfect. Got it? So now we are going to season our chicken breast. So, let's go. Now we are going to massage everything in. So now we're gonna put this aside guys and then we're gonna leave it for rough like half an hour. So guys, see you back in half an hour time. Now we're gonna give it our second wash with my apple cider vinegar. You see, all the vegetables are like vegetable apple cider vinegar. Take a look at my pop choy guys, all clean and ready for me to cut up. So now we're just gonna put this aside and then we're gonna move on to cleaning my broccoli. So let's put this aside guys. So now we're gonna cut up my broccoli and all my veggies. So let's go. And there you have it guys. My pop choy all cut up and ready for me to steam. Up next we're gonna cut our broccoli.
have you guys my broccoli's all cut up and ready to go with my pop choy. There you have it guys, my seasonings all cut up and ready for me to saute with all my veggies. Look at that guys. So guys, let's get this process started. At this point, I'm going with my vegetable oil. Just a little. So I could saute my chicken. Going with my vegetables. Now we're going to add our chicken. Now we're back to check on our chicken. Everything is coming along. Just give it that stir. It smells so nice, guys. Everything. All right, we're going to continue to leave it until the meat is cooked. So, guys, see you back in the next 10 minutes' time. Now, I'm going with my veggies. Going in with my carrots. What we're gonna do, we're gonna sprinkle a little water over it. Give it that stir. So we're gonna cover this, so see you guys back in 10 minutes time. Okay guys, as you can see, my chicken is almost finished. Brown and looking really nice. So now I'm just gonna add me a little water so I could get it tender. Just add a little, little water. That's like half cups of water, All right? Half cups of water. And I'm just gonna leave this for an additional 10 minutes time on medium low heat. So see you guys back in 10 minutes time. We are back guys and we're checking out our steamed vegetables. Everything looks ready now guys. Ooh, look at that. Let me just give this a little taste test to see if everything is cooked. Taste it. And it's cooked guys, it's cooked. Now I'm gonna add my chicken, but first, I'm gonna pour off some of the water, cause vegetable spring water, and look at the water. I'm gonna pour off some of my water. Okay guys, so we just poured off some of the excess water, look. The water is gone. Pour off some of the excess water. And now, to my pot, I'm going to add my chicken. This is how my chicken is looking. <laughs> the chicken is cooked and I'm ready to add it to all of that niceness. So guys, let's go. Now I'm gonna go in with my pop choy. Nice stir. Just 
store. I'm just gonna sprinkle a little salt, just a little, a pinch of salt. All right. Continue to stir it. Just wanna give it that nice taste, flavorful and nice. Let's give this a taste test, guys. I wanna taste all of this niceness. Let's give it a taste test. Mm, mm, mm. Oh my God. This tastes so good. I hope you guys try this recipe out soon. Cause it tastes really nice. So now I'm just gonna leave this for five minutes. Let everything combine together. Let's give this a little combination. And then we're gonna get eating, alrighty? Okay. So now guys, we are all finished. It's looking really nice, look at that. I like it this soft. Some people like it crunchy. I like it this way. So guys. We're gonna put this on a plate and then it's time for us to dig in. So let's turn our stove off and we're gonna dig in together. So let's go guys. So there you have it guys. My chicken chopped sweet and some sweet boiled potatoes. Can't get any better than this. So if you enjoyed this video, please do not forget to subscribe, hit that like button, and don't forget to comment and tell me what you wanna see me cook, again, in my kitchen. And also guys, turn your notification button on so you don't miss out any video that I post. Yum, yum, yummy. Try it at home and tell me how you like it, guys.